What is up everybody? Welcome back to Race 4 in the NASCAR Heat Evolution Career Mode Series, Chase for the Cup. Okay, so we're on the fourth race in the Chase for the Cup right now. We barely got by round one, guys, as I'll show you here really quick. Um, it came down to Dover. We finished 13th, I think, barely squeezed by by three points. And uh, we're actually 14 points, I guess, if you look at it. Um, so barely got by, guys. So we we did make it. We're into round two now in our rookie year on hard. So we are um, fresh start right now. We have Charlotte, Kansas, and Talladega. I feel really good about all those tracks. I feel like we could make it into the round of eight. We just need to get good finishes. Here at Charlotte, I believe we finished like fifth here. Uh, last race of the Coke 600. Really good race for us, guys. Um, really think that we can get another top five here. So we'll see how the, um, how the speed rating is going to affect how well we do again here. Hopefully it doesn't work against us. I know we have faster car now. It's, we have gotten like two or three upgrades since we've had this race. So I'm really excited about this whole lineup right now. So Charlotte, I feel like we can get a good top five, top 10, no problem. Kansas, I feel like we can get a top 10. Don't think we've raced there in the regular season before. And of course, Talladega, I feel like we can get another top 10 there if everything goes well. Go, 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 so let's see how we qualify here really quick. Um, again, not going to do anything crazy, just we're going to race conservatively, and then it's all going to come down to Talladega, and we'll see how we do there. Um, at Daytona, we almost finished in the top 10, but we finished like 12th or 13th. Really good race for us. Um, we have a lot more power since then, so I feel like we'll be in pretty good shape to get a good finish at Talladega. Um, I doubt we're going to be able to get the wind tunnel before then. We still need like a quarter million dollars to get that. So I doubt that's going to happen. But death before Daytona, I feel like we'll be in good shape for the Daytona 500 next year to actually get a win. So let's go ahead and kick this qualifying lap off. Had to get out of the gas a little bit there. So mess that corner up just a tad. See if we can't make it up here in this corner. pretty good it stuck pretty well right there let's see where this gets us hopefully a good top 20 that we can work out of 13th that's pretty good I can live with that so let's see where our chasers junior finished back there a little bit okay and Clinton Boyer is back there as well all right guys I will see you at the race So far, so good. Still there. They're not trying to. They're not trying to dive bomb us yet. So. Stay low. Still there. All clear. Car high. All clear. Oh God! Did not want to do this. Car low. And now Bane's looking underneath because that there. happened. Still there. Okay. We're able to get out of that. Might be able to pass uh, Keselowski in this corner. Hold your line. Ooh. Got risky. Still there. Still there. Can we clear true X? Yes, we can. Clear low. Up to seventh. Get on the still inside there. of Larson there. He's still up top though. Little trooper, man. Ready to go. He just got into me a little bit. 
Still there. Clear hot. Got a good run on the outside of Lagano. Wow. Still there. That might actually clear him before the corner too. All clear. This car's pretty fast, man. That was a great lap. Not bad for Cole flying 13th. Just trying to use these tires while we go. Still there. Still there. All clear. This isn't clear, but Car low. obviously I'm not. Clear low. Car low. Passing him and get by him. All right, up to fourth. Larson, not Larson, uh, Elliot and Kendrick are taking off a little bit up there. Now, if we're to catch lap traffic, I feel like I can probably get by them up there and get it slowed down enough. Harvick, he's actually pretty fast, man. I mean, they're probably like about the same, I think. He might be a tad bit faster. Don't see any lap traffic yet. Everybody behind us, Newman, he's a second back. I've got to get out of there just a tiny bit there. Overdrove it. And Elliot is about two seconds ahead. Man, not much going on right now. Hopefully we can catch this lap traffic here pretty soon. They might be able to get held up and get a couple more spots. That'd be awesome. That's like best case scenario. Worst case scenario, we get in a lap traffic and we get right. So uh, Elliot gained about a tenth on us those past two laps. That's it. So we get up there. I feel like we'll be able to hold them off. Still don't see any lap traffic yet. The Kenta is starting to fall back. Harvick is pulling away from us. So Kenseth 1.4, let's remember that. And just see if we're actually catching him or not. I think this is pretty much where we deserve to be right now is fourth. Um, all those guys ahead of us are just a little bit faster. I get so bogged down there in three and four. Okay, that's the halfway mark now. So... Elliot's starting to put on the gas a little bit. He's starting to pull away a little bit more. Still don't see any lap traffic. I wish we had one of those little track maps at the bottom. To see where everybody's at on the track. 
a lot of non NASCAR fans are like, well, you need to know where everybody's at on the track. You're not going in a circle. It, it matters. Especially for like pit strategy, you think you can run to a lap traffic or something, or whether to take tires or something like that, or I mean, it just it matters. Like our situation right now, if we um, if there's lap traffic, <clears throat> I feel like we have a good chance of catching them because they usually get held up. So I'm trying to calculate how many laps we're gonna have that we have lap traffic, if any at all. Oh, I thought I seen a little bit of a back end up there. He's three seconds ahead of us now. And Newman's still two seconds back. No pressure. And then Harvick and Kent with about two seconds ahead of us. So, we're pulling away from Newman. These guys ahead of us are pulling away from us. Looks like Harvick's going to pass Kenseth. Yep, I definitely seen a lap car up there. Eight to go. But can we catch them? Oh yeah, look at them. A whole slew of them. God, I hope we catch a man. That's what we need. Ooh, hit the apron a tad. So we're still pulling away from Larson now. Larson's got by Newman. They're actually catching Kenseth just barely. Just barely. <clears throat> Elliot, he is almost on that lap traffic up there. almost at the freaking wall. The only thing we really hope for now is that he actually catches him and gets held up. So we'll keep an eye on this tracker up here. And see how he handles him. He's actually getting held up already. We gained half a second on him just in that half lap. Five laps to go. Oh, Harvick and uh, Kenneth are really getting held up. How many, did you say five laps to go? Man, we just gained half a second on Harvick. This is good. I mean, there's not too much lap traffic right here. It's not too dense. I'm hoping that we'll get lucky. Like, Kenseth is getting caught up on this guy right now. So is Harvick. Oh, look at him. This is beautiful. All clear. Oh, this is beautiful. Still there. Let's go on the outside and see if we can just get lucky. Up to second place. Clear low. Yes, and they're getting really held up back there too. Oh, look at Elliot. Two seconds ahead. Oh, Rune almost against the wall. Damn it. That could have been our chance if we would have got a good run in there. Oh my god, look at Harvick. Clear 
Oh man, if we had a one more lap. Still there? Damn, just one more lap, man. We ought to have him. Awesome, top five. That's a good finish, though. Third. Ninety-four. Man, one more lap. We would have had him. <clears throat> So I'm curious to see where everybody else finished. That's in the top 12 for the round of 12. To see what we're going to be looking like. But Chase Elliott, he's not even in the chase. But Harvick is, so... Oh, man, that was such a good finish. 45 grand just for the winnings. Wow. 117 grand. So we're only seven points ahead of Edwards right now. No, nine points. Okay. So that's good. That's good. And we're now second in the standings. Going to Kansas. A new company is in Preston and wants to offer you a sponsorship. Oh my god, yes. Ooh. Definitely gonna go with Nature's Bakery because it is a Chevrolet. I'm tired of this Toyota crap. Oh, look at that ugly ass car though. Oh. So we have almost 400 grand, guys. If we were to get a good finish at Kansas, we would be able to buy the wind tunnel before Talladega, which would help us out a lot. Especially in the draft. So let's, um... I just want to check out the schedule one more time for the next round. I'm already getting ahead of the gun, but... So we have Martinsville, Texas, and Phoenix. For the next round. We might be able to win at Martinsville. Maybe. Or maybe even at Texas. Okay, I'm getting ahead of myself. But uh, that's it for this race, guys. We ended up finishing third... In our rookie season, we finished third at Charlotte in the round of 12. We're up to second in the standings. Still have Kansas and Talladega to go to advance into the round of eight. I feel like we're doing pretty good so far, guys. Just got a new sponsor in HS Bakery for double the amount for 25 grand per race. So that's going to be it for this race, guys. I really appreciate all the support on this, and I will see you guys at Kansas.